am here. I try something new. So you can see what kind of areas I'm uh, talking about. I find breaks in here all the time. I mean, down there under those trees. Uh, looks like the fire department just came in and the water company, somebody came in here and cleared this a little bit for uh, fire protection so they could get trucks in here if they need to. That's good because then what happens is they clear all the squatch breaks and then they become really obvious again. Like the road side, road block break ain't there anymore. So they cut it. Check this out. Look at this ravine right here. All right, and then over there on the far side, I see them. So I've seen them in the past, not recently, but they could be there right now. Nice foggy day, just hanging out. And then I've heard them down in this ravine down in here in this creek. And I've heard them at the top of this mountain. And on the other side, straight up and over from here, is where I got the shot of hidden in plain sight, hiding in plain sight. So they're, I mean, really, they're around here a lot. Might be kind of fun with the stabilizer when I get this done. Now that's the entrance to that ravine right here. And they, there's a little something. You see the fire department did this. Smashed all that coyote brush down. So that if there's a fire, it won't jump across the road. All their brakes are cut. Whenever it's a squatch brake, it's usually a brake brake, a twist brake, like that. Okay, that down there is a squatch brake. See that? Green twist. Oh, there's another one back there behind it too, see? That's a double brake, big brake. Okay, that is not the fire department. <laughs> or whoever does this work, prisoners or whoever it is, the Forest Service. All right, more later on patrol, tree picker.